This is Amanda Bartwood from Compass in Princeton. I'm at 62 Dogwood Hill in Princeton, New Jersey. This is a five bedroom, three and a half bath in colonial home, situated on 0.92 of an acre. It's 4,272 square feet. You see it's a lovely quiet cul-de-sac. A long driveway and a two car garage. And then as we go in, got these two beautiful bay windows at the front, one in the sitting room, one in the dining room. So you enter into an elegant foyer, stairs off to the side, and be hardwood floors. To the right, it's a formal dining sitting room. And a gas fireplace. And a lovely window seat. A cloak closet in the hall. And a powder room. Conveniently situated. And then you're into the dining room. A gorgeous chandelier. It's a lovely big room, custom mouldings, and a wood floor. You're from the dining room conveniently through to the large kitchen family breakfast room. This really is the heart of the home. New owners added this addition on with the demi vaulted ceiling with the beams, with beautiful lightings, beautiful lights throughout actually. Um, so it's quartz countertops. We have a large, oversized kitchen island. Lots of light coming in through these windows and also these skylights all through the year. White countertops. We have a six burner double oven with also a griddle. The dishwasher and microwave is actually situated in the other side of the island. And this gorgeous cabinet cabinetry here actually houses a large fridge and freezer. If we walk through the kitchen, we can look from the other side. The breakfast room to the side, with custom panelling. You can see through to the bar area. And then whilst you're stood chatting in the kitchen, you can Look out over the swimming pool. Look at this lovely Trex deck, which is oversized. And all the garden has been landscaped and leveled. Conveniently off the kitchen is a pantry. All of these rooms, all these cupboards. And then there's a laundry and mudroom with this herringbone floor. A large sink for washing the dog, if you have a dog. And then through to a mud room with cubbies. When you come in from the two car garage, which is, I'll show you briefly, slightly oversized. There's a good amount of space in here. All the windows have been replaced in the house over the last seven years, bar one window. Um, the rest have all been replaced. There's new roof obviously over the new additions which includes the kitchen and also the large family room. So this is the bar area. And that goes through to the sitting room. And then we have this wonderful family room with the vaulted ceiling and the gas fireplace, two big window seats. Do you step down to this this room, so full of light and space. And you can look out over the swimming pool. You can just feel the natural light. This is a very peaceful home. No detail has been overlooked. You can see the cupboards there. And that's through to the formal sitting. 
On the second floor, we have a large master bedroom with big windows, hardwood floor throughout the house, so obviously on this level as well. Hardwood doors have been replaced throughout the house as well. So there's a walk-in closet and then this is the ensuite bathroom to the master with a double vanity and a large stand-up shower. More custom lighting on the stairs. This is bedroom two. It's a good size room with a closet. A hall bath. This has recently been renovated. The double vanity. Beautiful tiles. Such attention to detail on the aesthetics in this house. Have glass tiles in the shower. Bedroom three. And large closet to the side here. Double windows over the garden. Bedroom four, I'm not going to take you into right now, but it's just there. You can see the photos on the listing. Third hall bath with nice stained floor. And this it has a shower over the top. Once you go into the cupboards, there's actually a lot of storage into the eaves as well, which is nicely hidden. This is bedroom five. Bedroom five is actually above the double garage. Again, storage in the eaves and a large closet. Now, because this room is over the garage, it has its own heating and cooling which works independently of the rest of the house. And that is just purely to make sure that the temperature in this room is always perfect. If you look out, you can see there's a basketball net. In the fully finished basement, you have a playroom, leading down to a movie room. You have the same custom molding, beautiful wood floors that are part of the aesthetics of the house. Lead through to a games room, currently set up with a double console so you can duel it out with somebody else in the house or a friend. And this leads through to an addition to the basement, added at the same time as the family room upstairs. So the large room is currently used as a gym, got two big windows and a good ceiling height. Maybe it could be used as an office space or anything else that you're looking for. So you come out of the French doors in the kitchen onto this large trek deck. It's oversized. It's a lovely place for entertaining. You can see the landscaping all the way around the garden. And the steps lead down to this amazing oversized saltwater swimming pool. It actually has an electronic cover to keep the heat in the swimming pool rather than evaporating off. Really can't think of many places I'd rather spend the summer of 2022. This is Amanda Botwood for Compass in Princeton. You can call me for more details on this listing at 609-727-3255. Thank you.